Hi everybody and welcome to the Audit Coach UC Talks with me, Jay Wyatt. And um, today I'm joined by Andy McDonald and the team from Colt. So welcome to you all. Um, you know, shall we do a little round table for our viewers um, so they know who they're speaking to or talking to? Yeah, that'd be great. So I'm Tim Cook. Uh, I'm from Colt Technology Services. I look after a team of sales specialists looking after our cloud voice division, which is includes UC and CCAS. Awesome. Hi, I'm Tim Hiscox. I'm a modern workplace consultant working in the strategy and transformation team within within Colt. Hi, good afternoon, everybody. My name is Andy McDonald. I'm the UK and Ireland country manager, uh, looking after the team here at Audio Coach. And I, I guess I actually should introduce myself as well. I'm Jay White, and I'm the alliances manager um, for Audio Codes EMEA. Um, so thank you guys, and you know thanks for the guys from from Colt for making the time today to to do this um, UC Talks video. Um, so quite an important subject, or quite a new subject, I think. Um, now, for those um, watching this, you may have heard back in June that Microsoft has launched a new voice connectivity option for Microsoft Teams. Um, Operator Connect. Now, in my head, Operator Connect, in its kind of simplest form, is a little bit like a calling plan, only it's offered through a, a selection of service providers that have been certified by Microsoft. Um, now, Audico's Live Cloud has enabled Colt's integration with Microsoft Operator Connect. And guys, keep me true on this. You were certified, was it last month, um, right. as being one of the service providers? Of offering Operator Connect, which obviously now extends, you know, you know, your existing audio codes um, direct routing solution. So, you know, I'm I'm sure, you know, um, our viewers would love to know that, you know, or, or perhaps you could explain why kind of Operator Connect, you know, is important and how the audio codes partnership has enabled Colt to deliver Operator Connect, you know, to your customers. Sure. Uh Shall I handle that one? Um, wh why is Operator Connect important? Um, I guess uh, it's generating $6.8 billion of revenue for Microsoft. It's growing at 700% year on year. And um, and I think they've currently got something stupid like 250 million active monthly users work using Teams. Um, so it's big, uh, you know, critically. And actually, more importantly, um, they've only got 80 million active monthly users using the, the the telephone system piece so you know there's a gap there and, and that that gap is is obviously a pretty big opportunity for for anybody who's partnering with microsoft to deliver voice services around teams and and we're, we're a big player in that and, and a telecoms operator so it was a big opportunity um you know that that's i suppose the most important thing and and microsoft had decided a few years ago they didn't want to operate in that in that telecoms operator space, if you like, it was too complicated, too regulated, too much governance, and, and too difficult to do, especially across multiple multiple geographies, of course. Um, and so, so that was that was thing one that they they wanted to address, and and thing two that they wanted to address was um, how do they play into the big customers with complicated enterprise telephony systems um, in a way that they did, for example, with their calling plans, making it really simple because be it not true or not, uh, direct routing as a solution seemed complicated. And from a big customer's perspective, complicated means risk. And they don't like risk at all. So, you know, that, that's why. So, so you know, why Operator Connect? Because it's a great opportunity. Um, it's going to grow massively. Why, why partner with Audio Codes, I guess? Um, there was two choices stand up your own infrastructure and all the resourcing and people and uh, and technology that requires or or partner with somebody who can deliver it much more quickly and and as you said about live that that was there already we were already partnering with audio codes um for our spcs that we use in our direct routing uh, solution so it, it you know the synergy was there already um and they enabled us to much more quickly hit all of the key milestones and key criteria that, that Microsoft make uh, oper Operator Connect partners deliver on. So, yeah, I mean, that, that answers your question. Oh, no, absolutely. And and I just wanted to kind of echo something you, you just said there that, um, you know, the big announcement was there are now 250 million daily uh, monthly active users. And quite an important statistic there that 80 million are using Microsoft phone system. For, so for those 
that our web phone system is the Microsoft um, calling plan solution. So that still represents a massive um, amount of users that aren't using, you know, the telephony side or the true, uh, what we call enterprise telephony um, with Microsoft Teams. Absolutely. So um, moving on from that, um, hi Andy. So how did audio codes enable Colts to deliver kind of Operator Connect? Um, perhaps you could talk us through that. Yeah, absolutely. As Tim mentioned, um, Audio Codes and Colt have had a working relationship around um, direct routing for, for quite some time using our live cloud platform. And when Operator Connect was announced, um, we worked hand in hand with the, the product management team to actually prepare for Operator Connect. We put a solid plan together so we could make that uh, quick uh, adoption of Operating Connect, put it all in place. Um, so we worked really well together um, to ensure we met the GA date on time uh, and in a seamless way. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing that business now growing out. I think what Tim was saying about the simplicity that Operator Connect brings, I think that's going to help so many businesses to really adopt Teams uh, as, as their single UC solution. Um, so, yeah, we worked through that project at speed collaboratively, and we, as Audio Code, see Colt as a strategic partner. Uh, and look forward to not just adding this, this Operator Connect functionality, but we see that Operator Connect really is a, is a gateway. It's an enabler to a much broader migration and an adoption of different tools that, that we bring for, for Colt to, a, to adapt to those businesses, business challenges that are out there, such as complex IVR requirements, attendant consoles, um, analog requirements. So yes, it's part of a, it's a part of the solution. It's a critically important part, but yeah, it fosters and enables future growth for both parties. Awesome. Thanks, Andy. Um, and so my next question is, is, is aimed at uh, Cookie, Tim Cook. Um, Tim and I, we've done quite a few of these videos together, and, and I think this question is going to be a little bit more sort of technical. So, Tim, what does Operator Connect bring to your customers versus direct routing versus the solution that you already had for um, or, or with Audio Codes Live? Yeah, uh, thanks, Joe. Uh, I know it's confusing having two Tims from Colton at the same time, so trying to <laughs> differentiate us. Uh, we're starting to use surnames uh, there, so thank you. Uh, so I know that question's for me. So. As you know, uh, we have for a long period of time been working very closely with Microsoft, uh, helping them on designing their voice capability, as well as supporting their customer base migrating uh, onto the Teams voice platform via direct routing. And providers like Colt have been putting solutions together around direct routing with our platforms and SBC capability. And that is still a very good option in its own right. In its own right. And, you know, if you were to ask me what does Operator Connect bring to the mix, it's effectively a, a customer focused solution within Teams to find a provider for an enhanced form of direct routing, potentially for customers who are out of region, don't know who we are, or they may know us in the region, but they're looking for a, a competitive plan that can be operated from within uh, the Microsoft Teams environment and delivered via their portals in a simplified, stress-free, standardized way. Uh, with a few clicks and a few setups, you can have a, a, an SBC and capability of Operator Connects routing to give PSTN breakout from the platform. So it just adds an, an enhanced environment to your Teams platform, a bit like the original calling plans, they added simplicity but it gives a partner view behind it that you may want to extend out of region. And that gives you a great value service on the back of it. So that's really where we're looking at Operator Connect. It's providing either existing customers with an alternative route via the, uh, the applications and APIs to deliver a service, or even potentially net new customers that haven't engaged with Colt before coming into region and looking for a pan-European type player there. So that's what we're seeing at the moment, Jay. Tim, thank you. That's absolutely awesome. Um, so my next question is for Tim Hiscock. Tim, um, why, is, why is Colt um, the preferred partner for Operator Connect? Right. 
Um, well, I guess the, the the initial answer to that is, um, you know, there are a lot of uh, uh, hoops to jump through from Microsoft just to just to, to, to get table stakes to be an operator connect. Um, and so there's only a few parties who can deliver on that anyway. You know, there's quite a lot of technical stuff, like you have to have, you know, um, uh, Microsoft Azure peering services in place. You have to have end-to-end -end, uh, cores across your network, quality of service across your network. And of course, you have to be an operator in region who's, you know, hitting all the regulatory and governance um, issues that I, I mentioned earlier on, um, as well as providing all the normal PSTN uh, kind of services like hosting numbers and what have you. So, you know, just to be at this game, you have to be a big player. And of course, Colts are, and that helps us. And actually, as Tim alluded to, the fact that we operate across, um, you know, all, nearly all of Europe. So we're a, a, a beyond just the UK and, and even to the France and Germany, we've got a much bigger reach. That in, immediately makes us an important partner for for Microsoft and, and you know, probably a preferred partner for many of the larger organizations. Um, so, so that, that that's one bit of it. You need to have enough investment to be able to, um, you know, get all of your certified engineers, be able to stand up a credible 24-7, 365 days a year support service to, to offer beyond tier one uh, support to your customers. So there's a sort of a scale as well that you need to have that, again, that we stand up to. But but I think, you know, so that, that's kind of a given. And there are other operators who yeah. are who are doing that and can do that. Our, our differentiator from my perspective has always been, you know, we do lots of what I've just talked about day to day and we have been doing it for a long time anyway. Um, what, I, what we do differently is the way we deal with our customers. And we've got one of the highest, if not the highest, um, uh, net promoter score in the industry. We've certainly got the highest net easy score in the industry, which means customers find us easy and nice to deal with. And so I guess I, you know, I'd say why our differentiator is is our customer service. You know, we're we're leading the industry in that way. We've we've just recently moved even more of a laser focus on kind of three principles of sustainability, uh, inclusivity, and diversity as a way we go around business. So we've got we've got those ethics as well in terms of the way we do business, which kind of really well aligns with Microsoft and audio codes. So all those things put together, we're capable, but we do it a little bit differently and with a little bit more customer care makes, I think, us you know, a really preferred option for customers looking for, a, for an Operator Connect partner. Absolutely. OK, and um, I've, got, I've got one further question that, that uh, is going to come left field. It's not more, so much a question. Clearly, if I'm an existing cult customer and, and I'm listening listen to this, this, this video and I, I now think, great, you know, we've been using Teams, okay, over the last 18, you know, 18 months, two years. Um, and I, I, now I think, right, I want to add the voice connectivity. Do I just reach out to my account manager to, to discuss um, getting Operator Connect from you guys? I'll let, I'll let Cookie field that one. He's uh, <clears throat> more in that uh, customer facing role. So if you are an existing customer, you will have a relationship with us uh, and usually that will be via an account exec uh, in, in one of our countries. They will be named to the account. They all know because uh, they've been very well trained on Operator Connect and also our CIC product set. So they know the ins and outs of uh, voice and PSDN and our CIC product set. And they know that if a customer comes in and talks about Operator Connect, they know what it is. And they know that they come to my team and engage with my team who are specialists on that. And yep. they will take the customer through, is Operator Connect the right way to go? If so, that's via the platform there, then through to the APIs. And then we will commission the, the solution via that route, if that's the wish, way they wish to go. Or there's some layers of complexity, then maybe we go on to our standard direct routing and SBC type capability there. Uh, but there's definitely a, a mechanism and everybody should understand it within the organization should a customer wish to do that. And if there are any uh, customers that sit outside of our existing customer footprint, they can either go via Operator Connect or use our portal to engage with someone within my team to start that conversation if they're not an existing customer of Colts already. OK, and there is also a, another option isn't there? that you can now actually go to the Teams Admin Center um, and you can actually click on the Operator Connect um, mm. uh, menu, and because you're now a certified Microsoft yeah. service provider delivering Operator Connect, you will be in that list. 
Yeah, exactly. So we'll be on that list if you're outside, you know, don't have those relationships, don't know where to go. You can see us within that uh, portal. Click on it and you'll be taken through. There's a there's a system and form to fill out. It gets sent through to to our systems. It then gets allocated to a team. And then there's a mutual uh, conversation that can happen via that point. Yeah, it's absolutely brilliant. OK, and one last thing. Um, if anybody wants to to find out more about Operator Connect from Colt, um, where, sh where should they go? Where, they where can they find information? So you would go to a landing page on Colt.net uh, into the voice platform there. And there's plenty of information and resources that are on there as well. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you, Tim. So, guys, once again, thank you, Andy, Tim and Tim. Um, appreciate it, as always. Thank you to our viewers. You know, if you liked this video and would like to see more, you know, please go to the Autocode social media pages, YouTube, LinkedIn. Um, and as just Tim just pointed out there, if you want to learn more about um, Colt and Colt's Operator Connect um, uh, solution for Microsoft Teams, voice solution for Microsoft Teams, go to the Colt.net website and um, go to the voice section and you'll find lots of information. I know because I've been there. Um, so thank you. Thank you very much. No problem. Thanks, Jason. Thanks for having us. Thank you.